hello guys welcome back in this video we will explore how we can use different icons provided by the end design and how can we customize their colors how we can spin them how to rotate and how we can create our custom icons using SVGs and how to use them in different components so let's get started so I have a blank react JS project that is using end design right now it is showing nothing we will be adding icons from the end design to see how let's head towards its documentation so these are the vector graphics and to use those we need to install this package so let's install the package so it will take some time so let's continue uh, while it is uh, installing the package so uh, end design has provided three type of icons the outlined ones and then the field and then the true tone right so they have provided a lot of icons uh, ranging from the traction icons having a different type of arrows and then suggestions the question mark the plus and then the editor edit cut paste and then few from the data icons like the pie chart and then a few from the brands like Apple, Microsoft, GitHub, Twitter and then a few from uh, the application icons used in different applications so also uh, these are available as, as a field ones and then few are available in the uh, true tones as well so to use any of the, these icons what we need to do is we only need to click on it and it says the uh, the component is copied so suppose we wanna uh, add a pie chart icon so we will copy it and paste it where we need it so paste it here so let's import it from and design icons so save it so if you go to the application it will show nothing because we have not provided any uh, reasonable size to be shown on the document so let's try to add the style to it so suppose we want to color it to purple and then the font size to be 100 now if we save it oh, here you go it has shown the icon right so let's try to use few more icons suppose one from the brand so suppose apple icon we paste it here copy and import it and for the size let's copy it and change the color to suppose green apple right save it here you go green apple right and these were from the field so let's try to use uh, one from the outlined so suppose we want to use uh, any of the icons like loading indicator so let's go and paste it loading outlines import it and for the style let's copy any this style and change the color to red and to make it spinning there is a uh, prop called spin we will add that as well and move to the application here you go it is has added we also uh, like the spin prop there is a prop for the rotation of the icon so suppose we want to rotate this icon and let's add another pi icon and rotate it to an angle of suppose 45 so that this pi appeared horizontally and let's change its color as well to orange here you go right so these were from field are the outlined ones so let's try to add few icons from the two tone so suppose we want to add this bank icon copy paste it import 
and then for the style uh, for the two tone color we need to give us uh, give a two tone color so it will be a, a primary color so for all of these colors there are one uh, base color and one uh, a little darker color so I've in each of the icons so we need to give a, a color and it will produce a, this effect so suppose for two tone color we are giving it a green color and we do not need to use the color here because we have already plotted the green uh, two tone color save it here you go right so let's try another line of icons so to divide let's use the divider from this uh, and design here right save it and it should be here yeah okay so also we can uh, add our custom icons as well so suppose we want an icon that is not available here and in that case we can create our own icons so for that let's uh, add uh, our custom icon so suppose we wanna say that hard icon so that will be a component that uh, will be passed some props and what it will be doing is it will be returning an icon so that icon will be need to be imported from the end icons so it will be returning this icon and let's pass all of the props to it so that we can pass the color and the font to this icon and then there is a prop here the component so the component will be again a function in which we will be returning any of the uh, SVG right let me copy one of the SVG and paste it here so I've copied an SVG okay so let's use the heart icon there and similarly we can pass it uh, the style suppose the color is red and let's make it a little bigger to 200 here you go All right and also we can add these custom icons uh, to the other react js uh, components as well so suppose let's declare uh, on the next line let's declare a button from the end design and let's say uh, button with custom icon and to its icon prop so we will be adding uh, suppose we want to add this logo to our client button uh, icon sorry. and let's import it and for the style let's add a style as well so color i suppose red and font size i think 14 is enough to be shown within a uh, button so here you go button with the custom icon and similarly we can show this in a simple text as well so let's add a p tag and let's say I love and design and instead of saying love here let's add a heart component actually the heart icon here and for the size let's make it suppose 30 and the color to be suppose hot pink and uh, for the style of this text let's say the color is black and the font size I suppose 30 what you have chosen here 30 
Let's see, it is 30. And save it. Here you go. File of end sign. Right? So, similarly, you can add any of the uh, icon uh, provided here or any custom icon we have created here and we can add it into different end design components or within the text. Alright. So that's it on exploring the icons from the end design. So if you have any question, please let me know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed the video, please hit like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. See you in next video.